Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, and back to another episode of Teardown, the game where you can do... That. And today we're going to be continuing on with the campaign, but I'm a little bit frustrated right now, a little bit disappointed, because I have some bad news to admit to you. And, uh, that news is that I've already done the missions that you're about to see. And the reason why I've already done them is because I've already recorded this video once, but unfortunately, the sound did not get recorded. Somehow my audio sources got switched up when I was installing a new graphics card. And, um, Teardown without audio, a destruction-based game, it just, it's not worth it. So I've decided I'm gonna do these missions again and show them to you rather than explore it for the first time like normal. Because even in a game like this, it's still challenging even if you've already done it once before. Even if you've already done it once before. All right, so the first mission that we have here is Malice in Wonderland. And you can actually see my previous stats here. So we have to help Locked Up Lee. <laughs> There's still like stuff demolishing around me. We have to help Locked Up Lee sabotage Gordon's Wonderland, destroy the neon signs for at least five of the rides. So let's go ahead and replay this side mission. This one was actually really interesting. So check it out. What we have to do, whoop, wrong button. What we have to do is um, destroy the signs. There's a bunch of signs over here and they're hooked up to electronic sensors. So as soon as you destroy one sign, the 60 second timer starts. And the thing is, these signs aren't just one sign. So this is two pieces, as you can see down here. Uh, this one is three pieces. You can see the three individual pieces. They're all moving around and everything. So that's what makes the you can see like look at these look at these signs moving up and down This is this kind of feels like almost like an old western style shoot like target shooting uh, Game one of the things I really liked about this map was exploring the rides before actually doing the mission because there's actual rides that you can turn on and off and um, Have fun with um, oh, yeah, and there's music by the way as well. So check this out There is a motorcycle merry-go-round apparently so we can go ahead and start that, and we can even get on the motorcycle. Look at that. And um, the motorcycle makes an engine noise, and it has exhaust. But trust me, I've tried it. I've disconnected the motorcycle and everything from the... Uh, from the thi Oh, no! As you can see, I've accidentally shot one of the signs over there. <laughs> and triggered the timer. So I'm, I have to restart real quick. But you may recognize if you were following the series, the first part of the series when I first started Teardown, this is actually the first map that we played on that has the little canal in there. And there used to be where this tower is, that's where the tower is that we knocked down. And now there is the whoosh tower. And this is one of those like elevator drop rides and you can actually make it go up. And it takes a very, very long time to get up there. Actually, while that's going up, we can go ahead and turn this ride on. This one has the uh, the spinny seat things. There we go. Oops. Don't sit on that one. That one's uh, that one's out of commission. Just put some caution tape around it. <laughs> Imagine seeing that from like the uh, the audience perspective. They don't even bother to shut down the whole ride. They just put caution tape on the broken seats, and you just gotta choose one that doesn't have caution tape on it. That would inspire confidence, huh? All right. Anyway, the tower. When you press the drop button, it drops alarmingly fast. I feel like the g-forces on that would be a little bit dangerous, but um, we don't need seats anyway. We've also got uh, some bumper cars, and you can actually drive the bumper cars around. Look at this. Um, there's nobody else to, to really play with, unfortunately. It's just you. And oh, and as you can see, the bumper cars aren't that sturdy, so I don't think you'd want to actually have your kids ride on this ride because they might die. Oh yeah, almost forgot this one, the center of gravity. This is the sign I accidentally shot earlier. So this just, uh, this just goes around in a circle like this. You can't get in the seats on this one, unfortunately. And then I think this is the last actual ride. Uh, this is, of course, your classic Ferris wheel. You can't have a carnival without a Ferris wheel. And you can turn this one on as well and go for a ride if you want to. Oh yeah, check this out. We got the, we got the carnival games and stuff. I'm assuming this is like darts or something. Like, the board is supposed to spin and maybe you throw darts, but I don't have any darts. However, this one, we got the bottles that you knock over. And, uh, this game is totally rigged, as you can see. Completely rigged. You can, these, these bottles are like cinder blocks, practically. But don't worry, I got a backup. 
There we go. I'm the best at this game. Look at that. One shot, knocked them all down. Give me the prize. <laughs> Those aren't good bells. Oh yeah, that's right. And you even have a swan thing. And this one kind of bothers me because it's got actual motors on it. Like I thought the swan, the swan rides were supposed to be like pedal power, you know? But I guess not. All right, anyway, it's time to actually do the mission now. So when I first did this, I accidentally started the mission much like you saw me earlier. And somehow this mission's easy enough. You can just shoot the stuff with a gun from a distance. And I managed to accidentally complete the mission when I wasn't even trying. And as you can see, like, if you just have a good trajectory on all of the different signs. Oh, come on. All right, that one worked. Uh, where's the other signs? There's one there. Come on. There we go. There's one over here. Oh, get that one. Get that one. All right, that one's done. That one's done. There's two more signs left. Where are they? Where, where are the signs? There's one. Oh, yeah, that's right. This is the last one I almost forgot as well. And there we go. All done. Easy as that. I have like 25 seconds left and we just got to get to the escape vehicle and get out of there. So that was a pretty easy mission. Kind of fun. Low stress. Just enjoying a carnival as a side mission. All right, let's move on to the next one. This next one, this next one's a little bit more, a little bit more difficult, a little bit more intense. So this is back at the security place and we have to bring at least three intact nitroglycerin containers to the escape vehicle and avoid security robots. Yeah, that nitroglycerin is a very fragile and explosive, volatile material, and uh, security robots are the opposite of that. And they have guns that try to shoot you while you're carrying nitroglycerin. So, um, if we look around here, here we can see there's a robot right there, and uh, there's a robot right there, and there's a bunch of robots inside and stuff, and I have to pick up nitroglycerin, and bring it all, all the way back to this boat. And yes, I've been through this once before. And now for you guys, I'm going to do it all over again. And hopefully try not to die. And by the way, I did confirm when I was doing this for the first time, robots do in fact die in water. So that's a good, good thing to know. So is there water out here? I also found out something else cool, which I'm about to show you. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna attract this robot here. Let me uh, I'm gonna do something a little bit different this time He's already shooting at me, but don't worry. I'm just gonna be calm about this Ready watch this watch this I can grab his head. Oh, hold on. Hold on. It's not working I can grab his head and actually prevent him from looking at me like I can turn him Back and forth like this so he can't shoot me right now, but I found that when they're conscious as conscious as a robot can be when they're conscious, I can't pick them up off the ground. However, you ready for this? All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me use the pipe bomb, maybe? All right, that didn't work out very well. So if I, can I put this on him? Oh, get away from me! Get away from me, get away from me, get away from me! All right, now I can pick them up when they've been knocked out. And I'm gonna throw them off of here and into the water. There we go, now we don't have to worry about that guy no more. So there's another robot that I'm gonna do. I'm actually gonna just preempt this to make it easier on myself. There's one in here, and this guy was kind of annoying me. So I'm just gonna go ahead and lead him out here. I'm gonna make this mission so much easier on me this time now that I know what I'm doing. And we're just gonna do a little bit of that, grab him, and throw him into the water. All right, so now this area is gonna be a lot easier to deal with. All right, and in fact, why don't I just do this one right now? So there it is up there. I'm gonna go ahead and get up there and bring that one to the boat. So we only need three, but there are seven on the map. All right, so the fortunate thing about this is, um, although the containers are highly explosive, they are very well protected from impact because of this cage. However, they are not well protected from um, projectiles or bullet fire from robots. So they will destroy these things. All right, so I just got to carry it. They're also pretty heavy. I can lift them off the ground, but it's a struggle. It's a bit of a struggle. All right, there's one. All right, and the reason why I got that first robot out of there was because there is also one somewhere in this building down below. All right, here it is. So fortunately, we have an elevator right here. I can go ahead and bring this up. 
I don't know. It gets stuck right here for some reason. So I'm going to use a plank. And we're going to bring it up a little bit. I don't know why you can bring it up again after it stops and just this random in between. No, 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 no. This did not happen before. This is new. What? What? Ha why is this happening? <laughs> okay, hold on. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna use my shotgun to blast my way out of here. All right, I'm gonna have to restart. All right, and we are back. And this time, I'm gonna press the. Oh no! This time, I'm gonna press the stop button. <laughs> Why does this happen to me? Alright, I just wanna- Alright, I'm gonna use a gun this time for a little bit more precision. There we go. Now let's just grab it and bring it off there. Alright. I've taken care of the bots all over again. I've also gotten the first one again. I just did the stuff that you guys have already seen. So now we're on to new stuff here. Alright, so. Fun thing about this, where I threw this bot off. The boat is actually right below here. So if I'm very careful, and I just drop this straight down. There we go. All right, so that is the ones from over there, but now we have this one out here. So I gotta go up these stairs and into this building. Oh boy, there's a robot. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah, don't shoot me, don't shoot me, don't shoot me. Let me through, let me through, let me through. Let me through, let me through, let me through. What if I throw him out of this window? All right, hold on. Where's my rocket launcher? Ah! I'm stuck in here with him. Hold on. I killed myself. All right, so to make things interesting, I'm gonna do things differently than how I did them last time. This time, I'm gonna just blow a hole in the bottom of this floor here. Is that the floor that he's on, or...? I don't know. Hold on. Robot? Are you up there? Oh, there's a fire alert. Oh, I gotta get up there and extinguish this fire. Ugh! There's debris in the way. All right, come on, come on, come on. I don't want the fire alarm to go off. There's the robot. I don't know what he's doing. All right, I gotta do this and extinguish that fire. Yeah, follow me over here. Oh no, oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck with the glass. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ready, ready? All right, I just gonna grab him and throw him down the hole. You get out of here. You get out of here, no one wants you. All right, now I gotta extinguish this fire. There's, there's a glass in front of me. Ooh, valuable. There we go. All right, we don't need any fire. Oh, that was a $500 key? Wow. Okay, and there is this one. So I'm hoping that that robot is trying to make his way back up here. Because if so, I'm just gonna throw this thing down. I don't know where the robot actually is. Be careful not to hit this thing. I'm gonna save real quick. How about that? Open up that a little bit. I hear the robot. I don't know how close he is. All right, come on. Come on. All right, you go down there. Where is he? I don't see him. Did he really make his way all the way up these stairs? I have no idea where the robot is, but I'm not gonna press my luck, and I just want to get this thing out of here, because if he starts shooting at me, he might blow this thing up. Uh-oh. All right, good. It landed right in the circle. Where did that robot go? Oh, is that him? There he is. Wow, he's actually kind of close. You know what? Just for my safety, I'm gonna get him out of here. For my safety, I'm gonna attract the attention of the machine gun robot. There we go. Get out of here. All right. I feel like an expert at this now. Doing it twice? Okay, so now all of the other ones are in this building. And this is where things are going to get a little bit more interesting because there's not any water nearby these guys to just throw them into. So I got to be a little bit more stealthy. So there's one right there. I don't know how far you can see through glass. I don't know what his visual range is. All right, there he is. I wonder if this attracts his attention. I'm gonna put a hole in this wall, though. Let me just do that. I'm just gonna run away for a minute. Nothing, everything's normal. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. everything's perfectly normal. I think he saw me. This is bad. Oh yeah, he's coming this way. 
All right, what can I do? I'm in the bathroom. All right, how about I'll just get over here. Now I'm in the parking garage, I guess. I don't remember what I did for this one. Oh, there he is. He's in there now. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna block him in there. No, 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 no. I was supposed to block you. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. I'm trying to hide. All right, you know what? I'm putting a bomb on you. Oh, he's gonna blow me up. Okay, uh, he's stunned right now. I'm gonna try to throw him out of the building. All right, where's my rocket launcher? Okay, here we go. All right, let's get you out of here, please. I don't think I can lift him up over that. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need a bomb, I need a bomb. All right, there we go. Did that do it? Get out of here. There we go. Okay, all right, we got, the, we got him out of there. All right, now let's get this nitroglycerin out of here. All right, we got this. I'm gonna save real quick, actually. There we go. All right, so he's probably trying to find his way back up here. Let me look down real quick. Where is he? That's him right there. Huh. That might be hard to get around. Is he stuck or something? Let me do an experiment here. Is he... Is he actually stuck? I think he... Oh, his legs! That's just his torso right there. His legs have broken through that. So he can't walk right now. That's kind of amazing. Oh, no, 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 no. I fell, but now we can get a closer look. Look at this guy. You're useless right now. What if I get in front of you? Will you shoot me? You can't even aim down. This is, this is excellent. That is, I couldn't have planned that. He fell down just enough for his legs to break through and now his guns are pinned against him. So I can just walk right by him, I think. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and take this, hopefully right over here. And then right down here. All right, bye. <laughs> That's so amazing that he can't even do anything. Oh, and there we go. So that is four out of seven. I'm just gonna work our way up to the other ones. All right, I actually have one below me down. Oh, that went down farther than I thought. Okay, that's probably above me now. Yeah, now it's way above me. Well, we are in an elevator, so let's go up. Oh boy, there you are. Okay, what am I gonna do with this guy? Where is this one? Oh, oh, I remember this one. This one's actually really cool. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. If I can have him follow me out here. Look at that guy still down there. The water is still kind of far. You think he can make it over here? If he can make it over here, that'd be great. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, come over this way, please. Okay, come up here. See, I'm playing this way smarter this time. Is he land on the ice? Oh, he fell right through the ice, that was great. Last time, I was like, I was didn't realize I could throw him in the water until much, much later. So I was doing a lot of this um, just with them shooting at me and trying to avoid them. So this one is actually locked with an, an actual lock. But we got a handy dandy blowtorch. All right, so I'm back in here and I don't see the robot that I threw off this cliff anymore. So I'm going to assume that it's the coast is clear and try to do this again without exploding this. Let's do a quick save before we start using high energy flames around nitroglycerin. How about that? There we go. Now it should open. And I'm hearing a lot of footsteps near me. Did you did you find your way back in here? Why are you making me paranoid like this? All right, I'm just, I'm just gonna do it. I'm gonna take it out. I th this guy better not show up all of a sudden. Okay, here we go. All right, we're going. I think, oh, 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 no, we're fine. Everything's fine. Oh, <gasps> where are you coming from? What are you doing? You're up on a roof? 
What are you doing up there? Please don't shoot the nitroglycerin. What are you doing up there? That is so weird. How did you get up there? All right, hold on. Let me bring it underneath this uh, awning. Now I don't think it can see me anymore. That is so weird. I reloaded. Like, things shouldn't have been different. But they were. All right. Uh, I'm going to try to get that guy down here. Using a good old sh shotgun. Where is he now? Oh, look at the guy's legs sticking through. That's the other guy up there that fell through. How did you get down now? What? All right, follow me this way. Here it comes. All right, I got you. Don't worry, I got you. I got you. I got you. You seem to chill out, okay? In the cold water. All right, so the last two are up in this building. And I think I know what I'm going to do with these ones. All right, so this one is just sitting in here. But let me let me check the coast real quick. Okay, there's the robot. I'm going to throw that guy off the roof. All right, I'm just going to carve a hole right there. I should knock him out at the same time. Oh, boy, that was a big hole. All right, you get off of the roof. No, 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 no. Get off of the roof. Oh, don't take me with you. Oh, get your legs through there. That would be kind of nice. All right, fall. No, 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 no. Okay. What are you going to do? What are you going to do there? Are you stuck? What? Okay, I feel like he's a little bit dangerous down there. But you know what? We'll deal with them when we get there. Uh, let's work our way back up to where the nitro is. All right, so now here's my plan. I'm going to take the nitroglycerin. And I'm going to bring it back to the boat. Thought about this a lot. All right, so I'm going to take this. And I'm just going to toss it as hard as I can. Oh, no, no, not myself. Not myself. Just like that. All right, and then I'll deal with that after I get this other one. Look at that one right there. Okay. Now I got one more thing of nitroglycerin. And I'm going to go ahead and save real quick because these are the last two. And we do have a threat down there near where I threw the other one. And what I'm going to do is throw this one as hard as I can as well. Right off the roof like that. Okay, that did not, that did not go very far. It's okay. All right, now we're, we got them together. Let's just toss this one down there. We toss this one down there. All right, let's hope that we're clear. We still got that one that's sticking through the ground, but I don't see the other one. So I think we're all clear. Gently drop this one down. Just like that. All right, there's one. And now one more left and we're done. And there we go. I'll come down with you. All right, and that's everything. We made it. Yeah, so uh, it seems like throwing them in the water, just neutralizing them so that they're not an issue is probably the bigger brain strategy than my first attempt, which was just trying to not get caught. All right, let's head back to our home base and uh, let's check out the other emails that are leading us to our next mission. So this is really interesting and exciting, but I don't quite know what it means yet because this isn't a mission. This is just an announcement. With great pleasure, I present to you the Truck Terminator. Behold its glory. I've instructed my people to deploy this marvel tomorrow. It will be such a joy watching it take care of my problems once and for all. As a token of my appreciation for your sublime work, I have arranged a small gift. Since we have managed to keep each other's identities and whereabouts concealed, I had it placed in the warehouse on Hollow Rock Island. Pick it up at a convenient time for you. I'm certain you'll find your way in. So then we have this mission. We finally have a case. We got a warrant and I'm preparing for the raid against Hollow Rock. Just one minor problem. It seems he has upgraded his security once again and I'm not sure it's safe for us to head over there uninvited. Well, good news for her. He just invited me over to pick up something at Hollow Rock. I know how this may sound, but we've come this far, haven't we? Could you pay a visit and make sure that this place is safe before we show up tomorrow? So then at Hollow Rock Island, we have droid dismount. Clear the area 
for the big raid, neutralize security robots by dumping them into the ocean. So this one actually tells you specifically to dump them into the ocean. But if you want to see that, you're going to have to wait for the next episode. So make sure you are subscribed for that. And that way you won't miss more teardown and other fun stuff on the channel. By the way, you can definitely check out some other fun stuff on the channel right here on the end screen. Hope this video has earned your subscription. Anyway, this has been Scrapman, and I'll see you next time. Bye.